careful now because some of this foolishness, a lot of this foolishness is in the church. It has infiltrated and the devil has sought to deceive the masses. Heard a great father of the faith said it best. Satan's goal is not to create a new religion, but to create a false Christianity that looks so much like the real one that the real saints are afraid to speak against it. Wow. Y'all in the house? Yes, sir. Satan's desire is to deceive you from among you. When Satan came to Adam and Eve to deceive them up out of their identity in God, he did it from within the garden. So now we got all these people teaching things like this inclusion gospel. That says everybody's going to heaven whether they believe it or not because the Bible says Jesus died for everybody. And that there's no such thing as hell. Dangerous doctrine. Got homosexual pastors. One of the quickest growing churches in our country is the Vision Church in Atlanta, Georgia. Pastored by the bishop and the first gentleman. Talk about it, sir. Come on. That shouldn't make you think, ew, that's nasty. That should make you think, oh my God, have mercy. Yeah. Yeah. That shouldn't make you think, oh God, two men. No, where are you at? That's beyond two men. This is wicked doctrine, the perverting of the faith. But we're too busy arguing about whether it's in Jesus' name or in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Meanwhile, people are erecting entire churches with transsexual elders. We're too busy pulling out our picket signs saying men shouldn't marry men and women shouldn't marry women trying to fight people that don't abide by the law of the kingdom. We're trying to force unsaved people to live by saved laws. Meanwhile, saved people don't even don't live by the same laws. Say that, sir. Mm -hmm. We are out of place. We are off our post. The prophetic voice of this generation was not to become advisors to politicians. That was never our intention. But everybody wants a name. Everybody wants to associate with the big wigs. Get in with it. I don't have nothing against nobody in government. President Obama, praise the Lord. Whatever, I don't care. This isn't my kingdom. I live in another place. Yes. I abide by another rule. Yes, sir. I'm under the law of the king. His name is Jesus. I abide by this law. 